Hello again, and it's springtime. Last time I did a gardening video, I showed you how to get uh, cucumber seeds out of a overripe cucumber and how to save them. Now I'm going to show you how to plant them. You probably think it's easy. Some people stick them in dirt, put water on them, and hope they come up. There's a better way. I'll show you. Okay, what you do is you get yourself some kind of little containers you can do that with or something or other to put the uh, seeds in. I'm going to show you. You get a paper towel and you put some water on it. Get it nice and wet. Then you take some seeds. Now I've got 10 little containers I'm going to put seeds in, so I want 20 seeds. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, I can count. 12, 13, 14, 15, 17, 18, 19, 20. See how confident I am? Put out exactly 20 seeds. Okay. These are uh, Canadian cucumber seeds. <laughs> Canada number one. Okay. Now, let me just put that over the top. Make sure they're nice and wet. You don't have to go crazy. Make sure they're really stuck in there in the paper towel. I'm just going to cover that. And I'm going to put it up in the cupboard. Up nice and high in the dark where it's warm. And I'm going to check on them every day. And, uh, I'll show you that in uh, maybe four, five, six days. I don't know. I'll tell you. See you then. I'm back. And the seeds have been sitting in there for a while. I'll have to find out the exact amount of time. And see if I can zoom in a little bit. And we'll take a look at the seeds. And yes, you see, some of them have germinated. Not all of them, but a lot of them, most of them. Okay. See that? Hope you can see that. Now, I have a tray of soil that uh, this uh, thing can either go on top as a dome or can go underneath and hold the water. As you can see there's a, a space. So if I pour water in here, all over my bench. want the water to come up enough to get in these things. Okay, now to plant these guys, first of all, I don't know if I have 10, but I'll see. Just make a hole. down in there. Just like that. And 
I'm going to put one in each for now and then maybe extras if I have them. Down you go. If I was putting two, it's not a problem. Just put them like that. You can see what I'm doing. Now the leaves are in the seed. There's two leaves inside the seed, which you can't see, but. They're going to come out. Show you that later in a few days, I guess. Sounds a bit dry. Pause the video a second and I will get some more uh, water. Okay, I've put more water in. You can see it's above the level. And I'm continuing putting these little seed guys in here. Leave the seed up where uh, it can pop out of the ground. Left. I don't know if these last ones will ever germinate or not. It's okay. I'm gonna put a few more in there. They won't all have to start the same day. <laughs> okay. Seems to be all the ones that root. And we'll just I'll put some more seeds in here. I'm going to need one, two, three, nine more seeds. I'll probably put a dozen more in there. And you see the soil's gotten darker because it's sucking up water. So what I'll do later is I will remove a little bit of that water, maybe an inch worth, and let it sit. And now it's time put them under some lights, I guess. Just gotta cover up the root bit of it there. And when I plant these, the whole, I cut these up right and the whole thing goes in the ground. 
so it won't disturb them. Hopefully. I did that last year. Seem to work. Alright. Let's go put them under some light. Okay, I'm in my grow up and I've put the seed tray down under that light. And uh, the camera's gonna have a hard time picking that up. Especially if the LEDs are under uh, pulsating power. They're not getting a smooth current, they're pulsated. You get more lumens from a LED if you power it up that way. But anyway, that light is a pretty bright. I'm gonna get my light meter and uh, see what kind of lux we're getting there. Alright, let's see. On the ground level, it's uh, 25,000 lux. That would be equivalent to being uh, in the shade outside. I'm going to move the lights down a little bit later and uh, get it up to, uh, appears like 70,000. I don't want to give them full sun. Full sun's 110,000 or so. I'll give them full sun after they've uh, created some leaves. I might even move that up a little. It's about five times what a fluorescent lamp at three inches would give you. I don't like fluorescents. That's why I'm throwing them all away. Anyway, uh, once the leaves uh, pop out, you probably can't see me. Once the leaves pop out, I'll uh, continue this video. Well, it's been uh, two days since I put the uh, seeds in the ground. <laughs> it's uh, quite impressive. I put the seeds originally in the water about uh, 12 days ago. It took 10 days to germinate, two days to get uh, this far. Pretty neat. That's it for now.